can I cheese this? Well, if I can, shit. I can't cheese this. Uh, hey, welcome back to Outbreak Episode 2. In the first episode, we explored and survived. In this episode, um, we're looking to do more of that, I think? Oh! Wait, what? Oh, the cobweb caught me. Nailed it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, hey, what's this? Whoa, it's a whole little back area. Ha-ha! Look at that! I would have never found this if I hadn't accidentally almost fallen to my death there. Oh, this is kind of cool. You know, I gotta say, the map, or like the little building design that the author, uh, Alex, I want to say? I think it's Alex. The, the design that Alex used is really, really good. Or, the, or his building design is pretty awesome. Like, definitely, uh, definitely good. Um, so far, uh, the my first half-hour impression of the map is that it's... No, hang on. It's pretty good. It's a pretty good map so far. Uh, I haven't played a map quite like this before, where... The zombies were basically turned up to a solid, I'm gonna say, 11. Like, it's definitely a super unique map in that regards. Or it, it seems like a very unique map. I, I think he pretty well captured what it would be like to be in a survival situation like this, but in Minecraft. Uh, but yeah, so far, love the game. Oh, doesn't look like anything there. You think there'd be something in one of these barrels, man? It's like, come on. I wonder what this is supposed to be. Oh, wait. What's this back here? It's like a little... Ha! Baked potato and a poisonous potato. Potatoes, boil them, mash them, put them in a stew. Stew. I'm gonna put them in a stew. That was weird. Here we go. Oh shit, there's a lot more. Okay. This is just Kiting Simulator, the game. Oh, come on, keep running. Oh no. I'm down to one half of a heart here. One second, boys. I'm gonna need some more nutritional value for this next one. Just chill, I'll be with you. I will be with you in a second, sir. Sir, sir. Oh shit, I thought I heard something coming around me. Uh oh. <laughs> oh man, that's what I get for trying to eat bread. I'm going to take the ladder just to be a rebel. Oh, and it's a good thing I did. I would have never noticed that there's a... Okay, that's a pretty awesome looking library. And I go in... Oh, oh my, my ankles. I'm going to need a fish for this one. Oh, I think I did have to take the ladder anyways. So, uh, you know, the build is awesome. But uh, I do have a... I... I, I think it could have done a better job of conveying, like, the grim dark of a post-apocalyptic. Awesome builds for sure. I think it's just, I think it's missing something. But I can't build for shit, so I don't usually like to criticize map makers. Or I don't like to criticize uh, map makers too much. Because, again, I am, I can't build for shit. I've tried being, I'm... I would say, so, uh, so this kind of pertains a little into my personal life here. But I would say that I am not the creative type. Oh, hang on, I gotta, I don't, 
Is that the way forward? There's no way that's the way forward. I don't think this is the way forward, but this has to be the way forward. Otherwise, why would it take me here? Because I'm not going to be able to make that jump. Yeah, I can't make that jump. Ow. Jeez. I read that cooked cod is cooked god. I wonder if there's something... Mm, there's like... All kinds of hidey holes here that you would expect there to be shit in, but there's not. Okay, there we go. We're back up to full-ish health. That's that's going to be fine for right now. So where was I? I am. I don't consider myself the creative type. You know, when I do survival, when I do uh, tech it, feed the beast, whatever the friend group I'm playing with at the time is playing, um, I don't tend to build. I'm usually either gathering resources or I'm doing, or I'm built, or I I say I don't build. I'm usually doing the, uh, I'm usually doing like machine stuff. Uh, I tend to keep with my circle of comfort of mod packs. I don't really branch off from from my circle of comfort, which is the forestry mod for anybody who's curious. But uh, do I need to go over there? Is there a more obvious solution somewhere else? No. So I'm obviously not going that way. What? Did I do... <laughs> I accidentally stumbled on the solution there through sheer incompetence? So where was I? I am... So when I when I play mod... When I play Minecraft or I play with friends, uh, whenever, I am usually not the one who's building. I'm usually the one mining. I'll go out explore. I am not a builder. I... I lack... And this kind of goes to my through my personal life and shit even in even in real life i definitely lack what i would say i would definitely say i lack creativity that being said if somebody else has a vision i am able to execute that vision i like to think i'm able to execute a vi somebody else's vision really really well i've always kind of prided myself on being a jack of all trades i can you know kind of do oh nice chainmail so what am I wearing right now? I didn't even realize I picked up chainmail. Yeah, hell yeah. Let's put that on. Guess I'll grab a stone axe. Sure. So I, I definitely would not... Can, I am definitely not the creative person. I am not the person to be able to come up with a vision and execute that. I I don't know if that's because of a general lack of creativity or what the or what that is. You know, and I also have a really nasty habit of sticking to my comfort zone. Speaking of my comfort zone, am I going to be able to beat these guys? I think so, yeah. If there's any more than that, though. Uh, but yeah, I definitely have a really nasty habit of sticking to my comfort zone, sticking to what I know. Uh... I don't really branch out and explore creativity much either. You know, I'm... I don't really know how to become more creative. So that's why I'm always very impressed by, by map creators like this. And I'm, and I'm usually not one to criticize because I know it takes a lot of creativity to even put this together. You know, I, I still think this build is missing just something to make it a little more post-apocalyptic. But it's a phenomenal map. Very creative. But I, I definitely think that I lack just general creativity. Again, I can definitely execute someone else's vision, though. I used to do a tech crew for my local high school. I would volunteer there, and I would never be the one to be able to come up with, like, the ideas for builds. But if somebody puts a diagram in front of me, I know exactly how to make that happen. Maybe a diagram of some dimensions. I wonder what this is. Oh, that might just be... Yeah, that's just a building. So it looks like I'm going to need to get a couple of ladders from somewhere.
Oh wait, can I just hit the... Yeah! Ooh, an iron sword! Hell yeah! A leather pants I don't need a bow! So I finally have something to do with all these arrows I'm getting. I was really worried going into this map that I would run out of food, but this map creator is feeding me to death. And I like that a lot. So I might do this. No, I want you there, you there on the... Okay. But yeah, I'm just not a creative person, but I'm really good at executing, at executing a vision of somebody else. You know, I could never be like a CEO, I could never be a business owner, but I would be happy to put up the financial compensation and uh, do a lot of collaboration with that person, just as long as I'm not the one coming up with the vision. Uh, it's... I wonder what this is supposed to be. Am I in a factory of some sort? You know, uh, even so, for a lot of jokes that I have aren't my own jokes, but they're, you know, random shit I've read off the internet, I've read and have been able to apply in real situations. Did somebody say free ice cream? Oh, thanks at Magma, the YouTube on YT for the inspiration behind this build. Oh, that's kind of cool. Sweet berries and some honey. That's cool. Actually, that's hot. Hmm. But anyways, enough about me. Let's talk about fun things. Like, how am I going to die in this next in the next 10 minutes? Man, I love this map. Huh. Spoiled food on the shelves? Interesting. Oh, this was a parkour puzzle to get across. Okay. You know, I always thought it'd be like a real cool idea. Or maybe this isn't a parkour thing. Eh, I don't know. Well, maybe it was. Was it not? No, it isn't. Yes, no. Yes? Yeah. This is totally a parkour puzzle. Or maybe it wasn't. I think it's supposed to be going this way. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh, wait. What? I'm confused. What am I even doing here? Am I trying to get on top of the shelves? Is that it? I'm really not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. If this is a I think this is a parkour puzzle I'm supposed to be. I think it must be, but where am I supposed to go? You know? Oh, there we go. Cool, now that I'm here, now. Oh, wait. Aha! <laughs> I'm figuring out mechanics. Supposed to just nice, not nice. Dude, having an iron sword makes so much difference. And I'm sure there's how much damage does this do? Six damage as opposed to five. Wow, an extra heart of damage. I suppose an extra heart of damage could be the difference between killing something in three hits or killing something in two hits, you know? So I am, I, I am taking, like, extra time to... Oh, wait. Well, I thought I was taking extra time to explore, but I don't know if I'm supposed to be exploring this part yet. So this was a supermarket. Neat. Oh, hey, look at this. 
So full disclosure, as you know, I'm probably going to say a bunch. Ah, oh, shit. Well, that's all, folks. <laughs> oh, man, I got to go through all that again. Damn it. All because I got a little cocky. As long as I don't have to repeat the uh, the zombie horde, it should be fine. Actually, this, it appears that this doesn't necessarily go anywhere. Is this the way forward? Or is this the way forward? Maybe this isn't the way forward. Is there anything up there? Well, we're gonna find out real quick once. Oh, what's this? A library? Oh, I think I get it. No, I don't get it. Do I get it? Probably not. This looks like a, a shelf puzzle or something. Ah, here we go. the ladders that I needed. Cool, so I can... So in theory, I can just leave this section now, right? Unless there's better loot to be had. Ooh. There's some food and drink. Broken vending machine. Nothing in this post-apocalyptic world works. So let's see if I can... So, what are... so I have the ladders, so I have whatever I need to advance to the next area. Unless, oh, this was just actually the way out. So let me grab, what are we doing on food? I'm doing good on food. Me build. Okay, I think I get it. So this world is basically broken into different areas which serve as the different levels or the different puzzles in each map. So eventually we'll just hit a roadblock that we can't advance by unless we meet a set of conditions. But whatever this condition is, I don't like it. I've never known the zombie apocalypse to uh well let's see what this is so according to the you son of a bitch I was about to say nice things about the creator but he's pulling that shit damn it oh wait the invisible walls suck. Come on, heal, 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 heal. I wonder if the honey bottle will do anything. Oh, nope, it doesn't look like it does. Well. Damn. No, I thought there was a door there. So anyway, uh, I was about to say nice shit about the map creator, but then he pulls that on me. As I was saying before I was so rudely killed, uh, according to the map description, uh, this map should last about two hours, depending on your level of exploration. So I don't... Am I hitting an invisible wall somewhere? I must be hitting an invisible wall somewhere. Oh, hopefully there's a water source or a puddle or something ahead. Son of a bitch. I just, boys, I just need a second. I'll be with you in a moment. Wait, is that their limit? 
turn back now? Wait a second. Can I cheese this? Well, if I can... Shit. I can't cheese this. They called me Jesus Christ. The cheese Saya. The Lord is my Gouda. Hang on, boys. All right, so let's let's talk shop. Let's talk turkey. All right. I can't have you guys living. Like it's just not something that I can have happen. All right. I'm sorry. Thank you. Neat. So far, I wouldn't say I'm being super rewarded for exploration. Or I could be. I maybe have been? Have I? No, I haven't. Or have I? Is this going to come back to bite me in the ass? Or is this the actual way forward? This was the way forward, yes. Oh. <gasps> I can name stuff. Oh no, I'm gonna I'm gonna save my levels then. But that's awesome. Okay, that's kinda neat. That's definitely a neat feature. And through there. So the city that I is through there. But it looks like I'm going through Old Oak Farm. Oh, it's an amusement park. Uh, it's a jungle. It's a jungle. It's a playground. Just, uh... Oh, wait. Stick around. I could probably be making some real serious progress, but... I wonder what this map is like with more than four players. I feel like even with just me, just a single player, that I got that there's uh, that this wouldn't be super conducive to a. Uh, maybe that's why I'm finding so much food. Come here. I wonder if that's the way forward. Although, I think I just found our new screenshot. Our. Uh, Yeah. I think that's going to be our I think that's going to be our thumbnail for the next episode. So I think that might be the way. Oh. I don't know where the way forward is. I suspect it's through I suspect it's through there, but... Wow, look at this. Everything's all boarded up and shit. I think there's a way into that house. You know, I think I should just... You see, I don't know if it's worthwhile exploring this shit. You know, it, it probably is. Let, I'm gonna explore... I'll, I'll do exploration for the rest of this mission. We'll just kind of explore around town, see if we can find... I think that little area that I passed... was the way forward, but I don't know for certain. The zombie horses are kind of cool, though. Oh, there was a... Hmm. 
nothing. There's nothing in this house. Well, what the hell, Richard? Wow, I can't believe there is nothing here. Okay, you know what? No. No, 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 no. If I'm... Just keep going. Just keep going. All right? We're just going to keep removing. Huh. This looks like a lovely house. Or a library? Eh. Like, it's definitely directing me somewhere. This is certainly directing me around here like there would be stuff here. In there, there's a chest. How do I get to it? In that house, there's stuff. In that house, I see. I saw a chest. How do I get into it? How do I get into that house? There's stuff. There's things. There's items I need. Yeah. But that ultimately gets me nowhere. Darn it. There's got to be a way to access that house. store? No, it doesn't look like it. But there's a chest in there, and I want to get it. Damn it. How do I get in there? There's some secret. How do I jump between houses? Do I go into creative and ram down the door? Kind of hoping for the latter of those options, but... I'm a responsible Minecrafter. I, I won't do anything that's... Or there just could be no way. All right. Bummer. So there really isn't much for me here in this, in this little village, town, whatever. Or at least there doesn't appear to be. Oh, sorry. Something in here? Certainly looks like there would be. There's a chain there. The glass is broken like there would be something in there. Oh, there's something up there. How do I get in there? Possible to get in there? Oh, wait. I'm an idiot. Look at this. Oh, wait. Am I? Nope, that jump just might be impossible. Or is it? I don't know. Aha! Look at me go! Parkour master in action. That's what you guys are seeing here now. Nice. Nice. Wait. Nice? Nice. No, not nice. Wait. Why am I able to get up here if it leads to nowhere? Oh, wait. It leads to somewhere. Oh, okay. Cooked rabbit, a spyglass, whatever that does. An iron shovel. Definitely going to replace that. Grab you, dump off. You know, I'm dumping off all these axes and wood shit in the pants. I'm going to be bold. I'm going to be ambitious. I'm going to inquire as to what the spyglass actually does. So there is a way to get in here. But how?
Ooh, maybe around the back. Or maybe that's what this house is for, as a entry point. No, that's not it. Oh wait, yes it is, I just need to look up. Okay, maybe not. Okay, one of these rooms in this house. I don't get it. Am I dumb? Quite possibly, but... Ugh, shoot, whatever. You know what? Screw it. Horse, come back. Ooh, there's... There's stuff in the children's playpen. Aha! Stone sword, eh. Chainmail, not bad. More bread, more apples, more arrows. All good, all good, all good. The golden chest plate plus five armor. That certainly beats this. Throw that on. And I'm fully armored, baby. Nice. All right, so I think this episode has definitely run a little long, but my urge to explore couldn't be ignored as it, sh it should be ignored, because here I go. Oh, oh, that was almost cool. That should be ignored. Ow. So I guess the next episode, uh, when, when we come back next episode, we've got to... Oh, There we go. Yes, I know infested horse is required. Oh, come on. Am I not able to jump that? Ha! Ah, nailed it. So when we come back next episode, we're going to face down whatever horde is here. But until then, guys, thank you, horse. Be seeing ya.